Oh. We've got yellow flag Yuki Tsunoda's off in uh, Is it the barrier? turn, turn four. four, the exit of turn four here. Yeah, it's a very quick con. He's done damage. That, You know what? Backward impact, the rear wheel looks like it's come forward. That yeah. could be a gearbox there. That's a rearward impact into the barrier. Tailwind comes across. Let's see if that's what catches him up. Turns it. Oh, he lost it even Great earlier entry. there. Straight away on entry. Might be all right then, is it? Gearbox, if it's... What do you this, think? What? It's just the way that the, the rear wheels, it's that funny little angle that he's got ah, in there, okay. and that's where it's going to... Well, okay, you okay. Stroll is coming. Oh, uh, sorry. Copy. Go yellow flag out there, and that is the reason we have a Haas into the barriers. Now a red flag as well. Top section of the track, we're approaching turn 11. That was very scruffy. That was a big one, huh? Hope he's okay yeah. with that, but it looks fine. Are you okay, Mick? Oh, I'm okay. Ooh. Long way before the corner, that, that was uh, that, that, that was heading to the barriers. Leclerc goes second fastest oh. overall, and that is Carlos Sainz at the final corner into the barrier. And you can hear the reaction from the crowd. He still managed to keep the engine going, but they have red flagged the session. Yeah. Sorry, guys. As he approaches the final corner. Oh. So that was a combination of the tires on the rear just raging hot and the wind from the back, and he just took a bit too much speed in. And these aerodynamics nowadays on these cars, they're so sensitive. Once you get a big step out, you lose a lot of downforce, uh, and then it just, it's, uh, it just goes worse and worse, and you just can't control the car. It is Hamilton ahead of Verstappen. Bottas has dropped three or four places, and there's Lando Norris touched and into each other goes Valtteri Bottas and Sergio Perez, and that's the Alfa Romeo and Alfa Tauri getting caught up as the McLaren spun round with the Ferrari as well. And Max Verstappen, I think, has gone tumbling down the order. Yeah, Max Verstappen has got caught out with that. On board now with Valtteri Bottas, and he made contact with both Red Bulls there. Bottas took out both Red Bull cars. Oh, just arriving far too quickly. Oh, this is the moment then. Oh, oh. he clipped the inside. Raikkonen just ripped to the rear left off, I think, hasn't he? Oh, f I hit the wall on, on the entrance. I don't know how much room damage. Yeah, we will check. I mean, we will check. Got a Ferrari and a red flag of uh, Charles Leclerc's Ferrari uh, into the barrier. Into Le Comte we go. So he said turn five. He actually lost the rear on the exit of turn six. Oh, such so an fun. unfortunate place. It all looked under control. It looked like he was actually preparing to go the other way almost. Oh. But it's oh, no. not great to see that if you are cheering for Max Verstappen this weekend. Oh, uh, it's finished. Okay. Copy. Ignition uh, one and then zero. Suddenly lost the rear. Copy that. As we ride on board, no, it's on the exi exit of turn Malmody. seven. Yeah. Malmody, yeah. Has Where he's he brought out a red flag and the session will not be resumed. So that's it for any on track action. The standing water where the drivers lose all grip and the potential uh, to go off into the uh, barriers until there's a red flag and a decision from race control. Lando Norris uh, will have to stay out there. Did the well, McLaren go round? Yes, it did. Yes, it did. That's Lando Norris. A rouge and up to a Radion. Lando Norris has had a big off. And you can see the tyre stranded. You can see the chassis revolving and turning around. Lando is moving. Lando, are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Sorry, boys. There's a lot of standing water. He's now back in the line. Yeah, oh, I see it. Just So it just started to wander into an oversteer and they had to correct it. And it was the correction that actually took him into the barriers. Now Sergio Perez in the wall. I don't suspect he's going to get that back out of there. I would say that's game over for one Red Bull today. And you can see how wet it is. Very hard to see. Oh, he's gone across the pane. And I think it's just bounced across the curbs. And then it goes, but that's too hard. That'll be the front corner gone. But at that stage, as a driver, are you a passenger? I mean, how difficult is it? Yeah, here he's on board. So what's he, what's he done here? I mean, Sergio wants to feel the grip because he obviously wants to make an impact, but he's just ran that. He's kind of found himself on the inside curve of turn six. It's kind of
Mr. Rumbled, he's lost the grip, and on he goes. This is what caused uh, the beaching problem and the off. Yeah, it's, <laughs> these cars are very tricky. They they don't slide. You don't get oversteering in an F1 car these days. When it goes, it goes. Uh, and I think everyone's going really light on the brakes there at the rear in that corner. Uh, I don't know if it's to do with the cameras or what, but it seems really, really tricky for everyone, even on the soft tyre. Are you OK? Yeah, I'm OK. I just have no idea what happened. Now, coming out of turn two, as we can see now. That's one B, isn't it? Yeah. And then that's two. Yeah, oh, just very late just lost how he's rear. lost the rear. Yeah, so it's actually well, sideways in. Yeah, it's a, that that is rear a really big knock. hit. Yeah. And he's doing about 110, 115 miles an hour at that stage before he loses the rear. That's a hefty impact. And, and I would be worried if I was Carlos Sainz about my gearbox there. I think he's carried a bit too much speed through the corner and it understeered. He went a little bit wider than he wanted to and then that camber change has caught, caught him out. The weird thing is it's quite a slow oversteer. It's quite a slow moment, isn't Come it? Come around slowly, yeah. yeah. Head down. Oh, and he's, I was going to say he's very aggressive on the way in. And he was. Too aggressive on the way in, and all the anticipation that was building in that Williams garage. George Russell is out of qualifying. If you're not pushing, you're not trying. And he was definitely trying, and he was definitely pushing. He's on the limit. It's going to happen at some point. Do you know what I mean? He can't have a perfect qualifying <laughs> session every race. another Williams and that is a bigger impact and that's Nicholas Latifi very much out of qualifying and that is another red flag and I dare say that could be this session not resuming as well. Let's have a little look then. Right on the edge or just over and he does the same thing here. He just gets a wheel on the dirt on the turn in. There's a car on the inside that never helps because it kind of disrupts your direction of, of, of vision into that into that corner uh, and he's gone a little bit too far to the left hand side put a wheel on the dirt and that's what spun him round. Turn eight and we get to with Latifi and as soon as the rear got away from him he was heading towards the scene of a barrier uh, that's a lot of damage to that car as well. I mean that is a big impact you, you can't imagine how much that hurts he'll have a headache for a, for a day or two after that. I'd rather get the feeling we had a, a Fettel spinner. Oh, he's gone for the inside, lost the rear, but uh, was able to collect it up. Oh, there's that Bottas. That was just Bottas. missing. He lost about 1.5 seconds, one and a half seconds in that first sector because he was the car having to take evasive action. Perez on the outside of turn one, braving it around the outside. Normally the quicker line to get a good exit, but he's behind. They're in the very fair. Oh, couple of bits of contact there. Because I think there was a harder hit, wasn't there? As we cut the way to this particular shot, well, we might just see it again. There's Lando Norris trying to push him wide, and that was wheel to wheel. They're robust if you hit them in the right places, these cars. You could hear the wheel spin. Yeah, that was a big lift of the, the tyre and suspension.